Hello everybody, welcome back to Pokemon Sword and Shield. In this one we're going to take a look at how to catch and evolve a Sneasel. Uh, there are a few things that we're going to need for this. Obviously, first we're going to get a Sneasel. These things um, seem to spawn almost all over the place whilst it's snowing. Hopefully I did actually get the Sneasel there. There we go. Um, you don't normally need to try too hard to find them. and They will uh, come and attack you a lot of the time they've found. Uh, we're going to try and launch a quick ball. There's a little bit of caught one yet. I have. Cool. So we're going to go ahead and throw that out there. Uh, once this is done, we are going to go ahead and see if we can grab else well not see if we can grab there is a uh, a guaranteed razor claw god damn it oh well you've made life more difficult than it needs to be let's try again another one he's probably gonna put it right down isn't it yep it's fine there's more of them around i, I, I want to get the quick ball on it just because it's easy mm -hmm. level me up that'd be great now it's turned into a grind. So sorry about this, guys. No, I don't want to do anything. Like that. Leave it alone. Cool. No, because I like doing everything in one take. We're keeping this in. Right, give me the sneeze one. And then we're going to show where you can get the... I think it's called a Razor Claw. There's two places we can get them from, so it's fine. I just want to make sure we get everything in. Oh my god, it does not want to go in. Isn't that a fighting move? That shouldn't work. Okay. Well, being as you've been caught before, let's get a repeat ball out here. Should actually be better than the There we are. Excellent. We catch a sneezer. Uh, add to pod, please. Let's add to instead of NK. I should say Malabar. Cool. So now that we have our sneeze on, we want to make our way over uh, to the Dusty Bowl. Um, now, I've obviously already picked this up, but this is where I'm going to show where you can get yourself a guaranteed Razor Claw. There's another guaranteed area as well, right near the beginning of the game. Uh, so I'll show that before we actually go ahead and evolve Sneasel. More sneezes around here. Wow, I could have come over here and got it. I'd have been even closer. Like I say, it does it does spawn in a lot of places. Um, obviously, all the Pokemon are showing like level 60 for me, but they'll be like level 38 or something um, if you just kind of come through the area. So you'll have a Razor Claw over this side. I want to say it's like, oh, there it is. Bam. And if it is a shiny, that actually, that actually means it's going to uh, regenerate as well on a daily basis, which is kind of nice. Uh, although, as far as I'm aware, the only use for using the um, Razor Claw is to uh, to evolve Sneasel. The next thing you're going to want to do then, um, let me just, you know, I was going to move on to Evolution, but I do actually want to show where you can buy these. Uh, so if you're end game and you just seem to have misplaced yours, you can come to, here we go, Hammerlock. Uh, the Battle Point shop in Hammerlock will actually sell you um, the Razor Claws. As well, so I just want to show this before we get into actually evolving. So this lady just here will actually show, show, sell you the razor claw um, for 10 BP. Should you need an extra one for whatever reason, shouldn't do but just in case. Uh, next up, you're going to want to make it night time. So for that to happen, uh, I'm going to go ahead and change time here, make it close to midnight, and then uh, basically you can pretty much guarantee that it's going to be. It'll be night time. So with that, I'm going to come out here now. It should be night time. There we are. Once that's the case, we are going to go into our bag. Find our razor claw. Give it to Sneasel. And then, give it a rare candy. And we should now have... Weavile. Okay, there we are. 
So I hope that was helpful for some of you guys. That's how you get your Sneasel to evolve into a Weavile in Pokemon Sword and Shield. Hopefully this was helpful for everybody, and I'll catch you all in the next video. See you then.